Hello everyone, it's Carla from Casey Creates. I know it's been a really long time since I've uploaded a video. Um, we've just had a really busy summer and we ended up moving from one location to another um, just because the logistics and anyway, a bit of a long story, but it's just temporary for about a year um, while we look for a house and we're, we're pretty much in the same neighborhood, just a mile down the road. But um, I wanted you to know I haven't forgotten about all of you and we do live in the North Carolina area um, and some people were concerned about our safety from all of the storms and I was sharing with a friend that we're sort of uh, getting a little survivor's guilt because most of the damage was a little bit southwest of us um, and then northwest of us um, in the North Carolina, Tennessee area. So we are very blessed and fortunate that all we got was a little bit of um, just a real brief power outage and um, trees down. But do keep the people of North Carolina in your prayers. And as of today, Florida, because of the, um, I think it's Milton, the hurricane that hit Florida just recently. Anyway, I wanted to just come and say hello and check in and let you know that all is well. I have still been crafting and what you're looking at right now is actually a journal that I covered. I didn't do the inside. Um, my sister and I like to go once a year and help out at a camp that we grew up going to. And this year we're bringing the craft project and the project is going to be covering a journal. Um, the scripture theme is uh, Proverbs 31.10. I can open this with one hand because I am videoing it with my phone. Let's see if I can get this open for you. Anyway, um, on the inside of each journal, we're going to put the scripture verse that says, she is far more precious than jewels. And then I just have a little uh, ring, red ring, that's supposed to represent rubies. Um, depending on the translation, it will say um, for her price is far above rubies. So I thought that would be appropriate. And of course, moving, everything is all over the place um, in different boxes still, my craft things. And so I can't find my pretty corner punches. Um, and so I want to find those so I can bring it. But this is what I think is exciting. My sister and I, who have way more crafting stuff than we need, just um, as a way of uh, being charitable, I'm taking loads of my craft um, supplies, my doilies, my laces, my trims, my bling, my flowers. And all the camp has to provide the ladies is a blank journal, um, glue, and a pen that we're gonna embellish. And we are gonna open up all of our goodies. We've already gone through all of it and cut all of the fabric to fit the journal. And they're gonna be able to just feel like they're in a grandma's attic sifting through all these laces and doilies and trims. And we're going to um, kind of coach them through covering a journal if they hadn't done one before. And I'm super excited to just kind of see some of these things get put to good use because if it sits in boxes for more than a couple of years, then clearly I'm not going to use all of it. So I think it's a good, um, a good opportunity to share. But I just thought I'd show you that this is the cover that I just showed, uh, created to demo um, to show them the possibilities of what they can create. And I put some of the trim on the spine and just wrap the doily around so it's like right here. And yeah, so I just wanted to make a quick video, say hello, let you know what we're up to, pray for us as we travel. The roads that we're supposed to take typically go through Highway 40, but that highway is closed now because of the storm and all of the roads that are out and the mudslides. So we'll have to take a different route. So that'll be a little interesting, but it's always fun to travel with my sister and kind of looking forward to having a little getaway. So 
I hope you all are doing well and are safe. I'm thinking of Debbie Vignola. I know that she lives in that area of Florida that just got affected by the storm. So Debbie, if you're watching this, I'm thinking of you and I hope you're safe. And to all of you who I haven't had a shout out to in a long time, just know that you are not forgotten. I hope you haven't forgotten me. I do plan to get back to crafting at some point, but I'll definitely be crafting this weekend. Um, so um, think of me and I'll think of you and stay safe. And hopefully we'll be able to check in again soon. Have a good day.